Hi there, this is Teresa. Welcome back to the channel. We are going to do H Zodiac sign Aries through Pisces. If you're in no contact, in separation with your person, we're gonna take a look and see what is your person's feelings, what is their energy, and then we're gonna take a look and see what are their next actions towards you, if any. Keep in mind it is a general collective. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. We are gonna start with Aries. Now, if you do want your own personalized in-depth reading, my website is timelessdivinetarot.com. I do have a 24 to 48 hour turnaround. Aries, what is your person's energy that you're in no contact or separation? Okay, moving too fast. Your person maybe felt like things were moving too fast. They might have actually lied to you about why they wanted to take some time apart or why they went silent. You maybe thought it was for something else, but this person really thought things were moving too fast. We do have the Hierophant coming out as far as their actions. Your person is trusting that while they're in separation, they're gaining the knowledge and information to know if they should invest in this connection or not. They're thinking long and hard about if long-term they see themselves with you or not. They do feel like there could be competition, but they also are conflicted because there could be some negative attachments that the two of you have had. Maybe you've had a lot of fighting or disagreements, and this person just doesn't know if the two of you can get on the same page. So for right now, they're not taking any action towards you. All right, let's look at Taurus. Taurus, the person you're in no contact with, what is their energy? Taurus. No communication came out first, okay? So there is still silence between you and your person. Your person does not want to communicate right now. What is Taurus's person's energy? One-sided, okay? So they feel like things were not equal, they were not fair, that things were one-sided, that maybe you wanted everything your way and nothing would be in their favor. Let's see what action they're gonna take, Taurus. Taurus's person, what's their next action? Okay, so we've got the Two of Wands coming out, the Tower, and the Ace of Swords. You know, your person is trying to be very clear about what they want, and right now, they feel like discovering themselves independently without this connection is really important. So right now, they're not ready to communicate. They are trying to keep it silent, but they may want to clear the air in the future after something has changed in their life. But for right now, they're not wanting to communicate. Gemini, Gemini, the person you're in no contact and in separation with, their energy, they've got temptation, so there could be somebody else that tempted your person. Temptation, we also have single. So this person really was just very tempted to be single. Maybe they would like to meet up with other people. They felt confused, that they felt like maybe you expected them to not be single and they wanted to be single. So let's see what your person's next actions are, Gemini. Okay, we've got the judgment coming out first. We've got the nine of pentacles, and we've got the king of wands. You know, your person right now is being awoken to that there's too much temptation. There's too much other people around them. There's too much of them feeling more happy being single than being in a connection. And this person is trying to do the mature thing by just not being in a relationship with you. Cancer, the person you're in no contact or separation with. Cancer, what is your person's energy? Cancer. Red flags, okay, this person feels like there were some red flags with you. Cancer. Unable to open up. Okay, so this person wasn't able to tell you that they felt like there were red flags with you, with the situation, with you. And it was really maybe hindering them and that could be why there is no communication. Let's see what their next actions are, Cancer. We've got the Eight of Pentacles coming out first. The Emperor, which is Aries energy, and the King of Swords. So there is somebody else here. And we've got the King of Pentacles. There's three people here. So... Cancer, your person could be really focused on work. That emperor could be their boss. And maybe their boss is somebody that they're also friends with. And their boss maybe told them, hey, you need to be really clear. This is red flags this person is doing to you. And it could be something that they felt like it could ruin their instability. And their boss, maybe if it is their friend, really let them know that this is something that is not healthy and not normal. But they didn't want to tell you that's why they're silent. They didn't want to tell you their boss, maybe their friend, influenced them to not say anything to you. Leo. 
Okay, your person is trying to figure it out, Leo, while in no contact and in silence, in separation. Leo's person's energy. Leo's person's energy. We have possibility. Okay, so your person is trying to figure out what the possibility is, if the two of you will come back together. They're trying to figure out what it is that they want. What do they want for their future? What do they want for their vision of the future? Let's see what actions they're gonna take, Leo. We've got the world, king of cups, and seven of cups. You know, your person's kind of living in a little bit of a fantasy. They feel like the possibilities are endless for them. They could have everybody and anybody that they want. They do consider you somebody that they potentially would want to be with, but they're still like pursuing other options. So they're not really able to be exclusive with you. They're still trying to figure it out. Virgo, Virgo, no contact and in separation. What is your person's energy? Virgo's person's energy. We've got caught and we've got bright future, okay. So Virgo, your person feels like they were maybe caught up in some type of situation where they had to make a decision. They were maybe at a crossroads and they're trying to figure out how bright their future would be if they were with you versus somebody else. Yeah, we've got the Eight of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, and the Eight of Wands. Somebody at a distance, potentially, that they needed to walk away from you. This person, potentially Virgo, they could have been caught in a third party situation. You were the third party. And they went silent because they got caught by their spouse. And they're already married. And they never told you that. And maybe their spouse told them, hey, you have to get rid of this other person or I'm going to divorce you. So your person chose to go silent. They chose to walk away from you because they did get caught. This person is trying to openly communicate with their significant other that they're trying to have a bright future and they are pushing you away. And that's why there is no silence. So if you felt intuitively that maybe there was somebody else, that something wasn't right, that's why. Libra. What is Libra's person's energy? No contact in separation for Libra. Libra. Indecision. Okay. Libra. And gossip. Okay, so your person's been talking to other people. They're indecisive. Maybe people around them have said things that have influenced them to go silent, to have no contact with you for right now. Let's find out, Libra, what is your person's next actions? Okay, we've got the lovers, three of cups, and the six of wands. Yeah, this person told um, their friends, maybe told them that they should move away from you, that they were maybe sharing with uh, their friends that they were just more into you for physical reasons, not necessarily because it was more passionate and lustful, not really love or long-term. And as they shared that with their friends, their friends maybe made them feel more indecisive, that they should really grow up and move towards somebody that is commitment material. So that could be why this person just went silent on you. They didn't want to tell you that. Scorpio. All right, Scorpio, what is your person, your no contact and separations energy? Scorpio. Scorpio. Drama and blindsided. Okay, so if you had something that your person got caught up with you and with other people, it caused a big fight, he said, she said type battle, your person was blindsided by this. Did you tell other people something that got back to your person It caused a bunch of misunderstandings? Well, your person blindsided you by going silent because they did not want to be a part of drama. So let's see what actions your person's going to take, Scorpio. Seven of Cups, Six of Cups, and Ace of Pentacles in reverse. You know, your person is really in this energy of feeling like there's too many other opportunities out there to deal with somebody who's so dramatic, who is going to do things behind their back. And your person, even though they think about the memories the two of you had shared up to this point, they're very nostalgic about it, but they feel like it's a bad investment for them to continue to invest in a connection that they just can't trust and they don't feel comfortable with. And they were maybe blindsided by your actions. Sagittarius, the person you're in no contact and in separation with. Sagittarius, what is your person's energy? 
we've got rejection and wanting to reconcile. Okay, so something about plotting is coming out also. So Sagittarius, your person feels rejected. Maybe they wanted to reconcile with you, but you thought they were maybe plotting something. And maybe this is now why your person is in no contact or in separation with you. Let's see what actions they're taking next, Sagittarius. Okay, we've got the Wheel of Fortune, High Priestess, and the Knight of Wands. You know, your person feels like change needs to happen. They weren't really plotting anything. They were trying to trust themselves. But, you know, whatever they did, maybe they did it impulsively. They did it maybe in a lustful manner. So whatever they were trying to do, they felt rejected by you, even though they were just trying to be maybe close or intimate with you. Capricorn. Capricorn, the person you're in no contact and in separation with, what is their energy? Confession. Okay. Capricorn. Choices. Okay, your person maybe did not confess to you that they have other choices, other options. So let's see, Capricorn, this person you're in no contact and separation with, what is their next actions? Capricorn. King of Swords coming out first, the Death card, and the King of Pentacles. You know, your person is really being truthful with themselves. They have plenty of other options. They decided to end the cycle with you because they were going towards more secure, more dependable connections, people that they could realistically see a future with. Aquarius. All right, Aquarius. The person you're in no contact or separation with. Okay, it looks like they may want to communicate. Communication came out first really fast. They have some codependency on the connection between the two of you. So let's see what actions they're going to take, Aquarius. This person could be in their feelings and emotions while the two of you are in separation. So let's find out, Aquarius' this person, what is their next actions? Okay, we've got the Queen of Pentacles coming out first, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Six of Cups. You know, this person feels like maybe they missed a chance with you, but they're very nostalgic. They wish things were a little bit more practical in this connection, but they're not. But they do have a sense of codependency. So they could be looking at a lot of your pictures, looking at your social media. There's a lot that this person is um, reminiscing about. So you could feel that energy, but they're not coming towards you right now. Pisces. All right, Pisces, the person you're in no contact and in separation. Their energy, play hard. Okay, they're playing hardball, playing hard to get. Pisces. Fear of intimacy, okay, this person has a fear of intimacy. That could be why they're playing hard. Let's see what actions they're going to take, Pisces. Okay, we've got the moon coming out first, the Knight of Cups, and the King of Pentacles. You know, this person does have a lot of anxiety when it comes to intimacy, about opening up, about being in a commitment. You know, this person's really sensitive when they think about uh, proposing or being in a long-term relationship. They, they want to be dependable and realistic at the same time, but they're really playing hard. Like they're kind of like the turtle that's going inside their shell. Like sometimes they come out and maybe you feel at times that they were more sensitive to you, but then they go right back in and they don't fully open up. So right now it looks like they are going to try to come towards you in a more charming way and hope to be a little bit more generous with their uh, communication. Okay, that is what I have for you. If you do want your own personalized in-depth reading, my website is timelessdivinetarot.com. I do have a 24 to 48 hour turnaround. Have a great day. Bye.